Hi all, Miss T here again. <clears throat> now I've just make it, made a start on turning my new bowl and until I get my video actually sorted properly I can't really operate. This is on my phone so I can't really show you it actually turning. But this is a piece of mahogany which I find in tricky to say the least as it's quite got quite an open grain. Excuse the mucky hands. Um, but yeah, it's uh, we're winning a bit, you know. I'm going to have to um, make this a little bit pro prominent. I'll be using a glue block. And I've made a f other few improvements in the workshop today. Where I've uh, got a slightly better dust extractor system using a, an old air intake off an old VW that I found under my bench. It's an old, old, an old VW Scirocco actually. Um, it's the uh, air cleaner. Off that, part, part of the air cleaner. I've also got a little fan to sort of blow the dust away from me. And I've repositioned my my light which is now up on the shelf out of the way. And uh, by the way, that's uh, that hot rod is a number plate off my old hot rod when I used to race on hot rods on circuits on the ovals. Yeah, I've done many things in a, in my many years. <clears throat> so uh, that's about all. Um, it's a little bit more. It's not so much a bowl. It's uh, more of going to be a small cauldron. In actual fact. Um, there's a few that that's going to be squared off. Uh, it's quite got quite a coarse grain. This mahogany, which is a bit of a, if you can see it. Uh, but <clears throat> I made a few mistakes to begin with until I actually got by looking at Mike Walt's video. Um, actually managed to master my um, well not quite but learning to master my. Uh, bowl gouge um, I was holding it wrong dug it in got a few catches but we seem to have uh, got on the right side of it now so yeah I'm quite pleased with it so there we go okay that's all for today maybe do another proper little video later